All right, this morning we're here with Michael Libertini for Smart Money Mondays. Today we're discussing the most compassionate expense on your bank account, charitable giving, right? Yes, good morning, Steve. Uh, more people than ever are reaching out to help one another. In fact, Americans gave over $400 billion last year to charity alone. That's the most ever recorded. Which is great, because it sounds like more people are getting back into giving. Yes, they are. Okay, so suppose I've never done this before. How do I get started? Well, the first thing you should do is find a cause that you're passionate about, whether it be something you believe in or simply something having the greatest impact in your community. The next is finding the right organization. Okay, with so many charities out there for so many different causes, how do I find the right one? There are many online tools to help understand how this organization may be utilizing your donation. It's, it's also imperative that you find out which is causing the greatest impact for your personal cause. Which is great, because then we can feel a little bit better about what we're giving to, right? Some of the benefits of giving to charitable causes stem far beyond just the donation alone. It can actually impact your overall well-being. Yeah, how so? A recent study shows that a person giving $5 to someone else is actually happier than spending $20 on themselves. Another interesting fact is that people that who regularly give to charities seem happier and wealthier than people who do not. And that's a great return on investment. Yes, it is. One important thing to note is that recent tax changes have altered the way that you can itemize your deductions. So if you're seeking a deduction, it's important to consult a local tax expert. All right, so you don't need to give a lot to make a big difference. Tools like GiveWell.org make finding the right charity easy, and giving back can actually improve, like Michael said, your own well-being in addition to helping others. If your budget is tight, also consider giving your time as an alternative to monetary donation. Organizations are often looking for sweat equity as well as special skills as a donation as well. All right. Thanks, Michael, for having us to learn a little bit more about this. Thanks, Steve.